I am Omar Hope in Hiring Gay's Communications and Police Engagement Manager. Today we've just wrapped up a fantastic event here at City where we've got to see what the four school partnerships have been up to since last year's event at the House of Commons. Today was all about showcasing what happens when the primary, secondary, tertiary and higher education institutions, the charity and private sector come together to collaborate because the Harringay African Schools Partnership is all about creating a mutual exchange of transformative educational capital. I'm Professor Indrajit Parmar and I'm a Professor of International Politics in the School of Policy and Global Affairs at City St George's University of London. I'm very pleased today to be able to uh, host the event organised by the uh, Haringey African Schools Partnership. The amount of energy and excitement and passion and humour, the sort of ways they think and speak, I thought it was amazing. I've never seen anything like it in any university setting that I've ever been in. My name is uh, Esther Awovia Kafia. I come from Ghana, um, along the coast, eight years ago. I established Pioneers International Academy. Uh, the goal is really to develop leaders uh, using education as a tool. I'm doing an EPQ. Um, my EPQ question is based on um, has colonialism affected the identity of black women? So I feel like it's going to help my EPQ because it's going to make me look at it from different sides, not only from the side of like Western ideology and Western culture, but also from a side of, you know, real like Africans that live their life. I love this morning and um, I could do this four days a week and still be coming back for more. We want to know what young people think. And I think most of all, I want to thank the young people for the contribution that they made today. I think it's interesting not only to witness and be a part of because we're all people of colour, all people from the different backgrounds, we all study different things, we bring our own perspectives to it. So I think it's going to be very interesting and hopefully bring about a lot of change. I want to thank um, Hope in Haringey for even the vision for this to happen because you know, that was the vision, that was the idea, and it brought the young people together. And I think what we've done here and what they've enabled us to achieve is a learning in an environment that has used fairly little resources. But if this, we can show it among our schools, among our communities, can do great stuff. So really, um, great work here. And I'm really excited I got to be part of it. Hi, my name's Tom, and I'm the Operations Officer at Hope and Haringey and I helped co-host the Educational Symposium. This Educational Symposium was a great event and it allowed our partnerships to mutually exchange transformative educational capital. As HIH's Operation Officer, I look forward to building on all this great work and to help develop the project moving forwards as our students dive into the key themes of IT and learning, oracy for democracy, literacy and resilience, and global perspectives on education. I'd like to say a special thanks to all that took part, including the schools, the charity and business innovators, and City University for helping us make this possible. Thank you.